Hi there, and welcome back to another episode of Randy Prizzle Reacts. As you can see, Katie Price has changed her looks again. This is the sixth time she's gone under the knife and done surgery, and she's ended up looking like a whole different person. You know, she did the remix to A Whole New World and all of that, because right now she's generally in a whole new world. This right here... It's the people around her that's badly advised her that's got to this point where now she just looks unrecognisable. You're going to go home to your kids and they're not going to know what you look like anymore. They're going to be like, I swear you used to look like this before, but now you look like that. And the thing is, the bad example she could be setting to her children as well. Let's not, you know, clown this all out. But the people who are advising her as well and saying, yo, you should go and get this done. Madness. Now, I just came across this on social media. I was just browsing through and I seen this and I said, Katie Price gets surgery for like the sixth time. And I'm like, my word, six, not one, not two, not three, not four, not five, but six times. It's just like the reverse book of T. Six times, six times, six times, six times, six times. I just don't know what to tell you, man. Like the Aaliyah song, I don't know what to tell you, don't know what to tell you. I mean, I've said it before. These people that go and get this work done, they need help. She needs help. Because this right here is not looking crispy. It's not looking iry. It's not looking grand like grand design. Yeah, no one is going to want to be with someone who looks like some creature that came out you know the dark depths of despair and let's be real she don't look great the people are saying that she looked great are the simps that are gonna just be giving her money and doing all this madness that she wants bro let's be honest yeah she's done done herself in there but the people who've badly advised her have done her in as well yeah they don't have her best interest at heart they don't they don't care right it's the reverse michael jackson they don't care about her and that's the simple thing but this is what it is. You surround yourself with all this bad vibes, bad energy, bad this, and that's what it's going to come to. This is real. This is real, girl. But it's mad. People say, who is she to blame for all of this? I mean, listen, the relationship she's got into probably has played a part. The whole media aspects, everything's probably played a part. What she probably did for a living probably has played a part. But it's the people around her that have badly advised her that have ended her up looking like this. It's crazy. It's crazy. But this is the bad side of surgery. This is a reminder to everyone out there. Don't get work done because you could end up looking like that. It's just as simple as that. We've seen it before. We see it again. And I'm someone who's an advocate and I say straight up of non-surgical procedures don't get stuff done because you could end up regretting it and this is going to be one of those things that's going to be on the regret list for her six times six times that's more than what randy orton has won though that's not more what randy orton has won randy orton's won nine championships she's on six six times champion surgical procedures of the surgical procedure and she's won six times well i wouldn't say she's won but you know she's, she's somehow got a record there but it is, it's madness but that's all i have to say on that it's crazy the bad people advising her unrecognizable to her children now they're gonna still think this is okay when they grow up and get old on you know what i mean like it's peak it's peak but that's all i got for you guys. Till next reaction video, I'm out. Oh, and one more thing. Money isn't the route to happiness. Just so people know. It isn't the full route. If you know how to do with money and deal with money in the right way, you'll be doing good things with money. Not ending up looking like something else. Someone else. Like the Arrow kind of monologue when he came in with. Just a final note on that. Till next time.